Hey guys, Zar here. Very quickly, we just had a closing candle on key support. Uh, you'll see it over here going back many, many days now. And now I'm looking for a drop below. Watching closely. Watching closely. I like to see a, a bigger a wick before taking this, but this thing could drop very hard without us. Even though we're into the dead zone in the markets right now, it's uh, 6.20 a.m. for me, my time. Two hours and 20 minutes into the uh, into the London session. I forgot what time of day I'm in <laughs> right now. It's, it's one of those weeks. All right. This is not a live order yet, by the way. Not a live order yet. to see more on the upside if it goes without me I'm okay with that I want a resourceful structure here so that I can take the most certain move as you've heard me say many times before looking for the most certain move here just over on my own platform just moving things around a little bit just in case we get that flip that I'm looking for there we go. I'm getting a little bit of a push up. I need more of that, more than that, though. Bear with my voice, folks. I'm losing my voice here. Recorded well over a hundred videos in the last uh, three weeks, <laughs> and it's uh, plus talking to my group and what have you. I'm just not used to talking that much, and my voice is taking a bit of a beating. I appreciate your patience. found that even during the lockdowns there for almost two years that uh, I did a lot less talking because I wasn't out and about and hanging out with friends and what have you. My voice, I think it got a bit weaker. So now when I'm talking all of a sudden again, um, it's just uh, it's a little bit harsh. I think other people have experienced that too. Some people have told me the same sort of thing. Not used to socializing, not used to talking as much and uh, you know getting back into it now in many in many parts of the world and uh, finding what how did my voice get so weak all of a sudden but that's part of the game it's been a very strange couple of years hasn't it just watching this All right, so we got a bit of a pullback. And so what I'm looking at, you see that didn't really pull back very much more than what I said. I think it did a little bit. But you can see here on the one minute chart, this is looking more resourceful because we were getting this, sometimes just about time. If we can have time in consolidation. That's as good as a deeper pullback. And I hope that makes sense to you. If it doesn't, we'll, we'll be doing videos on that and talking about it. But you see this pullback here on the one minute? More resourceful, we're getting closer to the, the 20. And now if we flip, all of a sudden, this order is live. It's almost like you can think about like a bow and arrow, like a, a bow being pulled back, tension, 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 to continue in the same direction. This candle is signaling, potentially, signaling this is the way I want to shoot my arrow, but I need to pull back first and then nail it. See that? Sometimes that metaphor is helpful to people. This is a live sell stop order at this point. A live sell stop order. Waiting for a break at the bottom of that wick. Sometimes I'll even take this higher, but not on this one. This is not the setup for me since we're still sitting at support. Key support, by the way. There'll be a lot of defending down here. It's 
be about a one-to-one -one for a quick 10 points. That's because we're kind of in the dead time right now. And this market will be defended down here, I believe. And if it's not, it will just drop like a like a knife through butter, as we saw yesterday after the FOMC announcement. Let's see what we have going on here. Very often these pullbacks, see this one minute? These pullbacks will happen in a zigzag formation. It'll look something like this, like this, like this, and like this. And that's a very resourceful structure. Often we'll get a nice push down after that. Now the reality is though, in this case it's a little different given that there's all these, see these bottom wicks? The zone is being really defended here. So this is a fairly aggressive entry. I mean, even the idea of expecting things to drop here without evidence, it's asking quite a bit. Let's see what the one market's willing to give us. This is the coin flip. I'm calling for heads. We'll see if the market wants to cooperate. Also watching gold a little bit. A couple of the guys in our group Notice that gold's looking fairly clean this morning, and so we're looking at that too. But here we go. There's the push. I'm in this trade now. In this trade, and just calmly watching. Nothing's changed for me. My heart rate is the same. Just trusting the system. The coin is still in the air. It hasn't landed yet. Just waiting the one minute stop now to the co above the current candle and we're done quick 10 points guys great trade thanks for joining me we'll talk a little bit later if you keep doing that a few times a day or a few times a week you can build real wealth thanks for joining us take care now